Okay, so in the world, there are a lot of fat niggas. Let's take a moment to be real for a sec. Like, there are a lot of fat people all over the place. There are fat people that are considered overweight, which means that you are a weight that is above what is considered healthy, which is a little bit bad, but not that bad because you could literally be overweight by one pound of what is considered a healthy weight depending on your height and your body mass index slash BMI. So there's overweight and then there's obese. Obesity is basically when your body is suffering throughout your enlarged arms, your legs, your feet, your face, torso, and hands and ass too when you're as big as these niggas your body is basically saying stop eating bitch or else i'll literally explode so now that we've gotten those two basic statements of information out the way i would like to answer a question that you may or may not have based on the title of this video do i hate fat people well fuck no bruh fat people are cool as fuck bro like they friendly they can sing, they fart a lot, and you know me, I love me a good roof of some rotten eggs mixed with gasoline. They are funny as fuck. And they can break through floors in case for say the elevator doesn't work and there are no stairs in a four level building and you need to get down somehow. Like for real, I let fat people flatten the fuck out of my face. But all jokes aside, I treat fat people like any other human being. But here's the problem that I have with some fat people. You know how there are these fat people slash fat models on TikTok or Instagram flaunting their fat bodies and rolls and flabs and making it seem like being fat is the new skinny and stuff like that? You know what the crowd of people in the comment sections cheering them on and feeding their ego like bro the meat riding's crazy first things first these fat models are getting their egos boosted by their so-called fans bruh and the result of this is that they don't realize that being a fat fuck is not okay like your body is desperately telling you to calm down with the calories and cholesterol my nigga now don't get me wrong there's nothing wrong with trying to love yourself regardless of how you look i, I know i said all those satire jokes towards the beginning of the video but it was satire nigga chill there's nothing wrong with posting yourself to help love yourself because ultimately it gives you confidence and it also gives others confidence that are in a similar scenario like yourself but uh, my problem is is that i feel like there's no balance at all when it comes to this in particular like let's all be real we all know damn well that being a size like this is not healthy at all nigga you can't come up to me and say that someone that looks like that is healthy and when people post these sorts of videos on tiktok you get a whole bunch of comments talking about how that person is beautiful and is gorgeous and ultimately gives that person confidence you know like i said like there's nothing wrong with that but i don't see a single comment talking about you are indeed really pretty but you should really lose some weight because the weight that you are at ain't healthy at all. This isn't a woman that is overweight. This is a woman that is obese as fuck. I also feel like a lot of people with obese body weights post themselves on TikTok to justify them not having to do shit because they're going with the narrative of, oh, if my fans think I am pretty, then I am pretty and I don't need to do shit to change myself, which is a problem in my opinion. Like there is no balance or acknowledgement or responsibility taken towards the obese people at all like nothing wrong with trying to boost your confidence fat niggas can be happy too just like any other person but when it comes to your health you need to realize that this shit ain't good for you man like i feel like the narrative that is being pushed out is that confidence in being fat equates to not needing to do shit like am i wrong or something like tell me if i'm wrong bro like like, like look at the amount of meat writing in these comments bro without a single comment saying you are very pretty but that amount of fat on your body is not good for you and you should consider trying to lose it but, but if you wanted to say anything like that or anything remotely close to that those same fat people are gonna just be like oh my god you're such a fat fool everyone else thinks i'm pretty so i don't need to do shit to myself or they just instantly block you because they believe they are pretty from being fat i gotta be straight up and say you ugly as fuck and it's not because of your features or nothing like it's not because of your eyes or your nose or your hair or your lips or nothing like i ain't finna come after you for your natural god-given features because you was born with them and you can't change them and it'd be pretty fucked up from an elegant nigga like myself to undermine your looks from that i only flame you for being a fat bitch and personally i wouldn't date a fat girl 
Sorry, but it's just my preference, bro. But if you were to tell a high egoed fat girl like this that you don't have a preference for fat girls, they would say that you're fat phobic. Like, bro, I'm fat phobic for not wanting to date someone that's fat as shit. Oh, my bad, bro. I guess I'm just fat phobic. These niggas would call people fat phobic for anything. These fools would call a construction worker fat phobic for not making a door extra big so that their EDP looking asses can fit right through it. These idiots would break a metal chair by sitting on it and call the creator of the chair a fat foe because they didn't make the chair strong enough for them. Like these speds would call Vogue magazine fat phobic for not putting fat models on the front cover of they shit. Even though they know damn well if there was a single fat person on that cover, nobody would spend even a nickel on that magazine. Like I feel like I should just be blaming the quote unquote fans of these models more than the models themselves because the fans are just pushing the fat niggas to be more comfortable with their bodies to a very excruciatingly high extent which is not really being a fan in my book bro like a real fan would tell these niggas what's up these fans need to stop meat riding these fools and tell them the real shit because ultimately that will help them so that you are able to live longer and happier if you try to at least acknowledge that then i fuck with you man but if you're just gonna go on tiktok and start flaunting your egotistical self thinking you don't gotta do shit and would rather let yourself rot like a bag full of garbage and think that when niggas give you advice they are fat phobic then you an ugly ass hoe so yes according to these hooligans i am a fat phobic i am a fat phobic for trying to save your life I am a fat phobic for trying to help increase your life expectancy. I am a fat phobic for actually caring about your ass. When it comes to people bullying fat people on the internet, I'm not really for bullying the person directly when it comes to giving advice on why and how to lose weight. I'm more of a person that would be nice towards that person, especially if they're taking the advice that I am giving him into consideration. I just don't mess with niggas like this that are entitled as fuck and feel like they don't gotta do shit when this has nothing to do with cosmetology or beauty at all. Obviously, when you lose weight, you naturally prettier, but it ain't necessarily about that. This is about your health. This is about how long you stay alive for. But I guess I'm fat phobic, right? If I'm a fat phobe for trying to help you out, then so be it, ladies and gentle niggas. My leg is a fat foe. <sighs> yeah, that's about it. Break a leg. Real trap shit.